guys. Thanks so much for clicking on my channel with all smiles over here. I am Will Sanja. It's like asking a question. Will Sanja help you keep your smile for today? And hopefully the answer is yes, you guys. I'm trying to keep it on. But y'all know if it gets good, I'm keep on talking. Y'all, I know I look different. I got this scarf on. Listen, y'all. I woke up this morning and decided I'm going to wash my hair and I'm going to moisturize my hair. And I said, in the midst of moisturizing my hair, I'm going to be cleaning up around the house and doing all types of stuff, okay? And then before you know it, I looked at the clock and I was like, OMG, okay? It's almost time for me to pick up these kids. But listen, I didn't have time to take the, you know, the rinse out of everything. And I, I, could, I just couldn't do it. So I was like, throw the scarf on, go up there, pick the kids up. But I said, you know what? I just can't go up there with just a the scarf on, what have you. I just got to put the face on, what have you. So I put my makeup on and that's why I'm like this, y'all, because I can't go anywhere with a jerry curl cap on yeah did you hear what i said i'm not showing up anywhere with a jerry curl cap i'm not even gonna come over here in front of y'all with a jerry curl cap i don't know I, no i can't do it i can't do it i can't do it but that's why i look a little different i just put this on right now you guys it's actually look a little cute but anyway you guys the golden nugget today is starting with blindfolds on starting with blindfolds on we all have been there one point in time in our lives. We have been there. And some of you may be there right now. What does that mean by starting with blindfolds on? That means you you can't see your way. It seems as if you can't see your way. You don't know where to start. You don't know where it's going to end. You don't know who to ask. You don't know what to do. You are just clueless. But when you're at that state of mind where you are blindfolded, what is there left for you to do? What is there left for you to do? There's one thing left for you to do, and that is to trust, capital T-R-U-S-T. -T. And how do you trust? You have to make sure that you what? Stay aligned and connected, which means what? You're allowing God, giving God the authority to move in and through you, thus you're able to move about in what? In clarity, right? And as you have that clarity going on, which means you're trusting God to lead you because the two of you have become one. He's the leader. He's the steerer of the ship. You get what I'm saying? And because of that, you begin to move forward in trusting. You can't see when you say, I believe you. I know you're taking me to where I'm supposed to go. I can't see a thing. I don't know if a car is going to come across the street, but I know you got me. I know you got me. I know I'm going to get there. I know I'm going to get to the destination. I don't know what the destination is, but I know you're going to get me there safely. And the thing is, the more you continue to move forward in that thinking positive and that thinking possible, which means God is, you, is, is moving in and through you and you're moving about with clarity, you will begin to have that blindfold to begin to loosen. The more you move forward, it begins to loosen. It begins to loosen. Then what happens? it comes off but when it comes off you don't really see as clear because you know if your eyes been closed for a long time and you open they're a little blurry still a little blurry you can make out images but still a little blurry you can see that there's something in front of you but you're still not quite sure is that it can, am i really seeing this thing keep on moving forward in clarity in positivity and possibility and then what happens your eyes become open and you see your destination. And before you know it, you're standing in the midst of what you have most desired. And at that moment, you guys, at that moment, you stop, pause, and you look around where you are standing in that of the most desired, of that that you have desired, that manifestation, right? And tears will begin to, to flow. And some of you may laugh like I do. I just burst out in laughter like laughing real crazy when I get super happy I, I laugh like crazy and sometimes I cry but majority of the time I just get to screaming and laughing and what have you but you begin to take in all that you're seeing of your most desire and the only thing that you'll be able to say I'm so grateful I'm so grateful that I'm so happy that oh you did and you got it me I'm glad so glad I trusted you I'm so glad I stayed aligned and connected or what have you you will be having one of those moments so listen to me if by any chance you're feeling like you're in a blindfold moment right now, trust and believe there is a destination waiting for you. And that destination is what you have most desired. You just have to trust and believe. In other words, stay aligned and connected, which means you're giving God all of the authority to guide you so that you can move about in clarity. And like I said, before you know it, those blindfolds will be off. And you will be standing in the midst of what you have most desired. And oh my goodness, that, that feeling right there. Oh, that feeling. Because you know how you, you, could, you can get there right now. Just pause and look around where you are. And then just have a moment and think back. Way back when, when you used to be blindfolded with a situation. And then you know you hear, it's like, oh my goodness. I'm so grateful I'm right here. Because when I first started, I couldn't see Jack. 
I couldn't see anything. It was pitch black. I didn't know where to start. I didn't know where it was going to end. I didn't know who to ask, what to ask, where to go, how to do it. I didn't know anything. But when I began to get aligned and connected, my path became, became clear. I had some clarity about that thing. And I was able to move forward. And it got me right here. So listen, keep pushing forward. Keep moving forward. And most of all, continue trusting. In other words, stay aligned and connected because your destination is where your most desired is. Your destination is where your most desired is. In other words, you're going to get the manifestation. You just have to continue to trust, continue to move forward in, in positive thinking and possible thinking and trusting and believing and knowing without a shadow of a doubt that what you are about to oh embark on is going to be so beautiful it really is i know i know you were frustrated a little bit a little rocky or what have you but listen it's going to be well 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 worth it because when you get in the midst of your most desire whoo it's like oh it felt like it was going to take forever to get here but i'm here i was here now i shouldn't talk like that with this thing on my head <laughs> Okay, I won't talk like that, y'all. Okay, okay, Christina, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay, but y'all get the point. You know, you, you get what I'm talking about, okay? Trust and believe you will be standing in the midst of your des of your most desire, and you're going to get that manifestation. Just trust. Stay aligned and connected. The blindfolds are coming off. You heard what I said. The blindfolds are coming off. You're going to be moving about in clarity, and you will get to that destination. I'll talk to y'all soon. Y'all stay encouraged. I hope, you, I hope you guys got the gist of it. I hope you got the gist of it. Hopefully, when I come back, if I come back on here today, I will not have this on my head. And if you see me tomorrow, I most certainly would not have this on my head. Okay, you guys? But I'll talk to y'all soon. I hope you, like I said, I hope you got the gist of it. Who is starting out with blindfolds? But trust me, you will end up in your with, with your most desire, and that is receiving that manifestation. Okay, you guys? If you take just a little bit of what I'm telling you and apply to your life to the best of your ability, you won't ever, 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 ever have to mask a smile. Why? Because your smiles will always be genuine. I'll talk to y'all soon. Be blessed, stay blessed, be blessed, stay blessed, be blessed, stay blessed. Y'all know what's coming next. Ciao.